this? How do you how do you do this? How do you just charge the door and not sell tickets? Uh, it, it's just, you know it is kind of a scary thing. It's always been a faith venture. Uh, God's just uh, been so faithful to us. We don't know any better than to trust Him. Sometimes I'll get out here. We'll be out seven, eight, nine, ten dates in a row and uh, into the tour. And I say, Eddie, aren't you aren't you scared? Aren't you worried that it's not going to go well some nights, some of these nights, and you're going to lose a lot of money? And we say, you know, I, I say, you know, I've seen God raise the dead seven nights in a row. I don't have any reason to think He won't do it again tonight. And so I just know God's able, and we just got to keep leaning into Him and trusting Him. He's the only one that can get people to come. He's the only one who can make these bands all work out like they do and make all this work. Something that shouldn't work, you don't sell tickets, you just let people pay at the door and pay a small amount of money at the door at that compared to ticket prices these days for the wonderful show God's given us and production and all the things we do. So it's amazing, but it's all about Him. I've said for years, it's God's tour. 100.7 KGBI and Safe for the whole family with new song and same God. And we've got new song in the studio. Hi, guys. Hey, how are you? Well, welcome to Omaha, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. So how is Winter Jam going for you guys? It's unbelievable. Yeah, it's going, it's going great. It's the biggest year ever. Uh -huh. And uh, we're excited, a lot of response, and uh, it's just a great night musically too. We love the the lineup this oh, year yeah. is is, is um, amazing. You know, every year you kind of wonder, okay, what are we gonna do next year? Right. How are we gonna top this? And and I, I really feel like we've got the best overall lineup we've had. Oh, it's ever amazing! In Winter Jam. It's so amazing. It's just hit after hit funny. after hit from these people that you guys have got collaborating with you. Yeah. Believe I can. You have a couple of questions. Well, I was just gonna say we were talking uh, just earlier, guys, about the uh, the the worship set. Uh, during the Winter Jam this year, and we were talking a little bit about how how just God is really moving through the, the worship set, and what are you guys seeing through that so far? Well, like Russ said earlier, though, it's God just put together a lineup that everything just seems to kind of flow. I mean, in, in years past, we've always had great bands with great songs, and that's there's no exception this year, but there seems to be something special about how God ordained the flow of the night, and there's a lot more worship that's happening. It's not, you know, everyone's playing their hits and stuff, but um, you know, new songs playing a different set than we ever had before. We end with worship songs, and then Carrie Jo goes on, and of course, unbelievable worship leaders. So it really sets the stage for uh, for when Nick Hall gets out there and delivers the gospel message, and we're seeing a, a greater response. Uh, than we have in any year past. When we just happen to know that Hope's found in a relationship with Jesus Christ, and so that's why everything that we do points to that, including Winter Jam. That's yes. always been the heart of Winter Jam, and it always will be, and that's the heart of New Song. That's why we do what we do. We just feel like God's telling us to you know, get out there and keep it going. Uh, time's short, there's a lot to be said and sung about, a lot to be done, and we want to be right in the middle of all that. So hopefully by sometime in the fall, definitely by the first of the year, we'll have a brand new project out. Hope to God, I know God's going to bless us with it. Uh, we met tonight and talked about some plans and some schemes and things we feel like God's telling us to do to get, get in that direction. So we're excited. Not only is Winter Jam 2013 starting to be put together already, we've already put one or two of the artists already. And we're excited about that. It's going to be bigger than this one, which is just crazy to say that, but I really believe it will be. Uh, we, we're right in the middle of all those things, too. We're working on a brand new project. So uh, I ask you to pray for us that all these songs will be God anointed and that we'll really touch people's hearts, help people, encourage people. And that's what our music's always been about.